Welcome, 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 you guys. This is Tisindra. I've kind of decided that uh, over the holidays, well, the Easter holidays, I'm going to have a lot of free time on my hands. I've, um, unless something shit happens and uh, I'll get called in. But let's hope that doesn't happen. But I'm planning on dumping uh, quite a lot of time into recording some stuff for you guys because... I kind of feel like I owe you. It's it's been kind of horrible. Uh, but uh, I've been having a very hard time sort of getting back into the swing of my other campaigns. And instead of like restarting on the same map, I kind of wanted to see. I still have uh, this save right here. You can see up here we have the gravitas facility that I unlocked. I got the old biome over here. I want to see the other maps essentially. So. Want to try that out? We have Oceania, um, and apparently these things here, these randomly get. You can just clip, keep clicking, re-roll, and some of these will just flip over. Yeah, you get a lot of frozen core. The core of this world is a block of ice, so instead of the core being magma, it's gonna be ice. That's interesting. Mixed boulders. A number of hard to dig boulders of various sizes are scattered around this world. Hard to dig. Is that going to mean like I need level 2 or 3 uh, digging to get past those? Several active volcanoes. Does that mean they're already out? Or does that mean that a lot of the geysers are going to be volcanoes? I don't know how this works. Um, Mixed boulders, small boulders, geodes. A number of large geodes containing caches of rare materials have been deposited around this asteroid. Um, I kind of want as much as possible. Irregular oil. <laughs> the oil in this asteroid is anything but regular. I don't know what that means. Can I get metal pour? I don't like that. That seems like it's difficult. Slime molds, small boulders, subsurface ocean. Below the crust of this world is a salt sea, salt water sea. I mean, how does this look? It's a lot of salt water, so I'm gonna have to desalinate. Turn, get the salt out of the water. I don't know how to pronounce that desalination thing. Small boulders, we got slimes, and we got random geodes. Is this good? This is good. Oceania is quite stable and resource rich, but the majority of the area is covered in saltwater ocean. Careful expansion and resources used should be should lead to a successful colony. Why does this thing pops up here? All right. Shall we try our best here? I'm gonna Essentially over the holidays, I'm gonna be playing a lot of these. I'm hoping to dump like three, four, five hours a day into this over the course of the next few days. Um, I don't want to make, like, a huge, like, three-hour episode, so I might chunk this down into, like, hour-long episodes like the other ones, but, um, yeah, this is essentially my way of trying to pay back what I owe you, I suppose. Oh, yeah, Jesus, I have to pick these things. So I have heard of some things that you should definitely get. First of all, you need one dude that is a rancher. Somebody like this. Somebody that has plus seven in husbandry. This is very important, I've been told. But I don't know if it works on this world or if it's just in the um, the uh, default one. I don't like gourmets. Oh, can I get another one with seven husbandry? Quick learner, that's not bad. Decrease bathroom use speed. I don't think that matters. And so, okay, we need somebody who can do research. And we need somebody who can do cooking. Operating and researching. I don't like interior decorator. He does not get a lot of morale boosts from high decor. So he's annoying to keep high morale. Anemic, I don't like that either. Alert, a hey, you plus seven size. I need you to have something else. Can't do cooking. That doesn't really matter. This is uncultured, so... Increase the core morale bonus. Okay, that's good. So you have supplying, which is useful, and then doctoring, which is situational. 
Yeah, but when you're not researching, you can be supplying. That's fine. So, I need you to be cooking and ideally digging. I don't like narcoleptic. So, we've got digging and cooking. Decreased strength. And another one that's uncultured. The lack of strength is not great. It means his carrying capacity is going to be, what, 80 to begin with? No, I can't. What are the chances I can get another cooking and digging one? Cooking, doctoring, researching. We don't need this guy. Cooking, digging, supplying. Can't do doctoring. Yeah, I like this. I like this. Um, I'm going to name you Bob. I don't know why. No, 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 no. wait. Husbandry. Uh, I'm going to name you Dundee. Dundee? How, I don't remember. How do you write Crocodile Dundee? Shit, 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 shit. Google. Uh, crocodile... It's with two E's? Jesus, that's weird. Dundee. Australia, you are weird. We have a researcher, kinda. Uh, name you smartass. Then we got cooking, dicking, and supplying. I don't know any good cookings. The last one was named was Gordon Ramsay. I'm just gonna call you, um, hmm. Uh, what's the name of that annoying dude with all the bacon? He's got a ridiculous fucking hairdo. Ah, I've only seen like he's like a really tacky like all he does is bacon in in America. He has a bunch of TV shows about this. Ah, let's see if I do American cooking show bacon. I'm actually gonna type that in. Huh. What is this? Make way for bacon? Is that the guy? No, that's not him. Ah, uh, I don't care. I'm gonna name him Bacon then. Because I can't remember the dude's name, I'm just gonna call him Bacon. Come on. Let me click this thing. Why is this not working? I can't rename you now? What happened to the interface? Did I, I minimized it and now it's fucked, or? Okay, fine. You can be Max. I don't I don't really care. You can be Max. Uh, so far this thing looks exactly like the starting zone in the other thing. Oh, except there's we're right next to a salt biome, and we're really far to the right, I think. We got granite and igneous rock already right over here. So let's see, uh, my four starting things. There's water, algae, copper, and coal. Uh, we've got water, and we already have a building down here inside a slime biome. So yeah, I can see the granite here is cracked, so I'm guessing we're already connected to another biome, being a slime biome. We already have slime lung over here, that's wonderful. There's a vacuum, there's a lot of copper here and some coal. And algae, all over algae. I don't think we need to worry about oxygen. And we got kind of lucky. We got two pockets here for free. Uh, vacuum, some CO2 up here. It's not that bad. Could be better. So I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to do this new thing that I would like to do. Essentially, um, I'm going to do... Starting, like... With the, what's this called? The printing pod. I'm gonna make that like a 16, a 4 by 16, and I'm gonna have some basic buildings in there. And uh, I I'm gonna have essentially two spines on either side of these, and they're gonna be big spines. They're gonna be like six, uh, yeah, I'm gonna make them six wide. Because I do intend eventually to get those, um, those tubes, those transport tubes, the Futurama uh, tubes. So this is gonna be the wall. They're going to be six wide, and there's going to be another thing here. Oh. Is this the boulder? We've got diamond obsidian. I am never going to be able to dig through this. Not anytime soon. So let's do, um, like this. Oh, Jesus. This is all very cramped, it feels like. I like to do my rooms, um, quite big. I don't know if I can do that. I might have to start them out small and then 
uh, make them bigger later on. Huh. I think we're gonna scrap this idea here. Let's um let's let's already start digging down. And I think I'll just have the toilets underneath this room. We'll do this. Do this and Yeah. So we're gonna do outhouse. And then we do medicine. I like to do, yeah, the 4x4 four four immediately. Just because eventually I'm going to delete this and have proper, like, lavatories and wash basins. No, sinks. They're called sinks. But that's just going to take a while. So, yeah, so there's got to be a lot of salt water. What's this? I can't, I'm even, I can't even see this until I uh, build the station, okay? I wanted to see, like, what's co it's called again uh, let me google something quick while we have these dudes do this uh, uh, desalination um, uh, if I do pronounce is there no thing here for this desalination Desalination. Okay. Okay. Got it. Desalination. That sounds very, very American. <laughs> okay. I got it. Desalination. It's like better call Saul, but it's desal. We've got to desal the situation. Um. Yeah, we don't have water. We could put a pump in here, but it's gonna. It's not gonna last long. So we already, we're going to have toilets and outhouses, uh, toilets, um, these are outhouses, outhouses and wash basins pretty quickly, hopefully before the first day is over. Uh, we got some mealwood, we got some bristle bosom. I don't know if I should tell them not to eat the mealwood because we're not going to have farms for a while and this is probably going to get disgusting later on. All right, we need, okay, so we're going to need to dig out some copper for, uh. For some power systems. Uh, I haven't even built a bed for these guys yet. Um, obsidian. So this is the boulders. This is really... Digging through this is annoying. And why is there phosphorite in the middle? That's... You use that, like, for a few plants. Like, the weaseworts, I think. Uh, there's gotta be more. But I remember the weaseworts needing this. But getting early diamond? That could be useful. If I check skills, very firm material digging. That's basically granite and some stuff. This is abyssalite mining. I need to get all the way to here to get diamond and obsidian mining. Jesus, okay. That is slightly upsetting. Okay, do this. I'm gonna go ahead, I'm gonna put one here and here, and then we're gonna make this into a room so I get some a tiny amount of morale. I'm gonna put it on speed 3 while they're sleeping. I'm gonna try, if I can, to play on speed 2. It doesn't always work that well. I think I'll put the beds on top. This is kind of awkward. Um, I need to start digging out granite if I want to make the rooms the way I want them. So I'm gonna need these guys to level up and hopefully the first duplicate I get is gonna be useful. because. When you get a duplicate for the first time, he immediately starts out with um, a skill, a free skill. We have, oh yeah, we've got, this is another salt biome. That's a bleach stone, so is this both? I don't even know if this world is actually different, if there are unique biomes to this. This is weird. Why is there a line of sandstone here? Oh, you guys are all idle. Let's not waste time with that. Uh, let's go up, shall we? And do like this, and we do like this. Dig this up. I don't want to dig the oxalite, but I do kind of want to connect some of these things here. A lot of sand. This is going to be interesting. 
this is like the first I've, I've tried launching i think most of the planets just to see the beginning i didn't really play at all but i just found them very very interesting and i'm gonna see like i don't think there's anything missing from like the first basic world here but there might be or i might have access to everything i would like would want uh, let's do the second uh, ladder. No, 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 there we go. Uh, I'm gonna delete you. I can get water later if I need to. I just wanted to get water for my wasp basins. Wash basins. The pronunciation part of this is difficult, and it's a shame because I'm trying to record something for you guys, and apparently I can't speak proper English. But then again, a lot of YouTubers can't. Am I, no, I, am I calling myself a YouTuber? I don't know. I'm on YouTube. I don't know if it counts. Oh, you're kind of stuck down here, aren't you? You idiot. Finish the stairs. Oh, right. You guys have no way of getting across. Let's get... Yeah. Because, yeah, the ladders are too far away from each other. Okay, so now you can get across. You're fine. I don't want you to get stuck. Ideally, this should be airflow tiles. And then you build something that you're not going to use that much on these. Like, I can build the hamster wheels for power generation on top of this. Um, I still haven't built a bed. There's no rush for that, I think. More, like, very low atmosphere. 180 grams of, of CO2 here. This is a thousand grams, but it's still, it's it's carbon dioxide, it's useless. This is all pure oxygen. A thousand grams. Cracking into this would be good. Okay, so of all the biomes, we have salt, chlorine, and slime. I can see slime. I can see the salt ones. Uh, the frost ones, I don't see one. And I don't know about the chlorine one, but I, I do see some bleach stone. Which just usually means to me that that's a chlorine biome, but um, I don't know. Yeah, we'll, we'll just have to figure out this world first. I don't know if I'm going to do a good job at it. Uh, I could just build uh, the beds over here. Uh, you don't have enough metal ore for this. Ah, wait, no, no. I'm gonna, I'm gonna change this. Usually I do 8x8, eight eight, but I'm gonna do 6 in each bedroom, and I'm gonna build, like, statues here. And ideally I'm gonna build two of these rooms. Oh, yeah, Jesus, the sand above here. Um, so if I build two of these rooms, that's 6, and the other one is 6, so I will have 12 duplicates, I think, uh, at the peak, which is fine. I think that's enough. I don't think I need more than that. I don't want to... Cut you guys off from the bathrooms. So get that built. I'm on speed 3. God damn it. That didn't last long, did it? Let's uh, let's get the basic stuff done. And then I'll slow down, I think. Maybe. Or maybe I'll just lie again. Okay. I'll keep going. I don't think this is a priority, dude. Just do this as a 4. No, no, no. I pressed 4. That doesn't work, does it? Okay, now we do this. Everything that was here has fallen down, so that works. But it fell into the bedroom, which is not great. So there is... This is probably going to be one of those uh, skill machines that um, gives you one of those... They're really good skills, but um, it's random what you get, which I don't like. You have no idea what you're going to get. First dude. Can't do digging. No. Buff, no taste. Okay, he's got low science. I like this guy. He can do cooking. I can have him farming or operating. I don't need him to cook. Yeah, look. Rowan... Uh, Farmer Bob. 
don't know why I like the bob. No, no. There we go. There we go. That's okay. 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 We are up to four duplicates. Somebody's stressed. Farmer Bob started out stressed. It's not, not a good start for you then. Okay. This has been connected. There's a lot of hydrogen here. I imagine if we're going to have a lot of salt biomes, we're going to have a lot of hydrogen. This might be just a, a hunch, but I think that's correct. Okay, you guys are now just chilling. So, oxygen is still good. We still have oxalite pumping out some free oxygen. I don't want the polluted water mixing with the others. And what is happening here? Something weird is happening here. Yeah, I can always go from the bed all the way to here. And dig this stuff out. But this... There is bleach stone in the salt biomes? Is that Has that always been there? Has, has there always been bleach in the salt biomes? Or are the biomes different here? We're gonna... I have no idea. Absolutely no idea. So, uh, let's do, like... Yeah, we'll do this. I'm gonna do this. And I'm gonna do... Oh, I need more copper? Come on, guys. Give me copper. I'm gonna make you like here. Can I connect this? I don't even have enough copper to do this. I did not choose like mineral, uh, no metal pour, so I don't know why it's happening. I'm gonna crack into this. I'll get the oxygen and I'll get the CO2 here. And a whole bunch of copper. Okay, so. I'm just gonna do like um, do that first, and then I'll hook them up later. So another boulder, or isn't it? yeah? This is this is just a boulder. So this is a huge one, and this is just a small one. But it it makes it very difficult to progress because uh, well, you need very high digging, and even if you have the digging. It takes a long time to chew through those. Why are you idle? Squeamish. Yeah, you can't do doctoring errands. That's fine. So who is going to be my research dude? Was it smartass? Yeah, it's got to be smartass. So we'll do priorities. No. And it's only going to be smartass. Cooking. Uh, it's going to be Max, which is kind of disappointing because I was going to name you something funny, like Bacon. Um, okay, so we have the basics here. We have a barracks and we've got toilets. Uh, we have no research selected. Just give me the basic, basic farming. And I'm going to have you accept everything that's edible. I'm going to make myself a seed storage bin. I could fix the flooring as well in all of these, but let's have uh, some priorities. Uh, we'll do this. Research requires water? No, it's it's the advanced research requires water. The basic one only needs dirt. You're going to have seeds. Okay. Mm. Yeah, here we go. Chlorine. Okay, nothing's different in that regard. The epistolite has been cracked, so there is, um... Yeah, the biomes... I don't like it when you get those really messed up biomes. It is... it's kind of frustrating. But I suppose it's completely random, then. He's got some blossom seeds over here. Uh, I kind of want to see what's up with this. I think it's a bug. Uh, okay, so what do I need next? I think I need a farm 
And then I need to think about how, what to do with um, waste. So I'm thinking, can I map this out? If I do here, oh, this is 16. This is basically a room then, but it does start with the abyssalite. What if I do from here then? I can get this, yeah. It works perfectly. Uh, the granite requires, yeah, I knew that. You need basic level digging for that. Uh, I can mop you up and then use this water for stuff. So just mop it up, mop it up. Uh, dig this, please. Uh, let's map things out a bit here if we can. This is good. How much water is this? Almost a ton. It's good. That's going to last a while. Basic research. Thank you. Algae terrariums. We got the farm. We got the planter box. We got the compost. I don't think I'm going to need using the compost a lot. I could. But we can turn... You, you can essentially turn slime and polluted stuff, polluted dirt and all that stuff. You can turn that into oxygen. You just leave it right next to a deodorizer and you get oxygen. So you don't need to. And plus, the compost produces a lot of heat. Like, if you keep composting for a very long time, the heat is ridiculous. I had no idea. Let's see, this is... Um, okay, 16. So this would be a room. I'm gonna have... Farmer Bob is going to go ahead and grab farming. Just so I remember that. Yeah, I got the video for duplicate morale. Don't show this again. I got that covered. And they can dig through the granite later. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. So we're going to have farms. Uh, we're going to start some more research. Get me... Um, what do I need second? I don't need... I would like the deodorizers quickly. But to get them, I would need the advanced research. Let's just go... Yeah, let's just go grab that. Food-wise, we're good for a few days. Water up there. We can just dig up and crack into that. I'm just going to go here and here and dig up this, and then this, and then this. That should have all the water, or most of the water, flow through. This can't be finished. That's okay, though. You could trap this shine bug in here and have a free light source, but you need a lot of shine bugs for that to work with the bristleberry farms. I think. Uh, let's also do a few connecting, like, bridges, walkways across the two ladders. Until we have airflow tiles, that's just going to have to do. So ideally, this is going to be one of the spines of the base. I'm, I'm hoping on building another one on this side. But we'll have to see. We're kind of cramped in here when it comes to the other biomes. It feels like our starting biome is tiny. Absolutely tiny. Uh, you picked up the muck root. Really, really quick reflexes there, buddy. Uh, you have now leveled up. So, Max, you are going to be the f cook. Go ahead and do that. Research complete. That is the water cooler. I don't really need a recreational room. What does that give again? It doesn't actually give morale for the room, but when they do get in there, they do get a morale boost. I don't know if you can turn the printing pot into a recreational room. What is the requirement? No industrial machinery. Is that Does that count the printing pod? If I do this, and I do this, and then I do this, is this going to be a recreational room? Is it? If so, that would be kind of cool. 
I don't know if I'm going to be taking another duplicate right now. We'll have to see what we get. If I get like an early Weezed Wart, that would be amazing. I had that happen to me once. I just got like a very early Weezed Wart and it saves you so much pain in the ass. You manage the heat immediately. Missing the core item. Oh. Well, we could get a decor item. We just have to research it. There's no penalty here to... Like, it says no industrial items. It doesn't say that. So if I add a decor thing in here, I could get a free rec room. Which is cool. So do this. Let's increase it like this. Okay. All the water is spilling down into whatever that's happening over here. And I'm tempted to crack into this, but I want the, the uh, deodorizer before I get it, the polluted oxygen. And look, this is, I think, the starting biome here. This something weird happened when this spawned. Okay, everybody's idle. Go ahead and... No, 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 no. Dig this out. I think I had the, uh, the wrangle tool selected there. Go ahead and take that. Okay, okay. Uh, second farm, maybe? Yeah, we could have... No, no, that's too low. Go ahead and dig this out. We can already have this be our farm. This is... Yeah, so... Do this. And then we'll just do a farm. We'll have the farm built early. Let's get the microbe musher like up here. I'll move it into a proper room later. It just it's nice having this central spine with all the, the little shit that you are gonna have to move or you want maybe want to move later. I kinda like this. I kinda like it. You idiots are stuck. Okay. Narcoleptic. I don't like that. You are ranching, which I don't need. Tiding, I don't need either. And digging, I think I got covered. I'll just take the food. Also, every single item that you get out of this printing pod comes out, like, very, very cold. I don't think the food. Usually when you get, like, dirt and stuff like that, it comes out at, like, very, very cold temperatures. And that's... helps. Like, I'm very, very conscious about temperature right now. Because I've had some very, very annoying experiences with temperature just killing my base. And it only, it's always the farm. The farm is the most delicate fucking building in the game. Uh, I started using uh, ranching to get an alternative food source, but it is so finicky. Like, I don't, like, I don't know how to properly do ranching. And I'm gonna have to figure that out. You can use ranching to get eggs you get raw eggs you turn them into omelets which is good that's uh it's a very good calories but um if i set I, I automated the process so that every single egg that got f that got found uh, immediately became omelets but the thing is these hatches have a lifespan eventually they'll get old and they'll die so i kept turning every single egg that they cra uh, hatched into food and then all the hatches died of old age, and I was left with nothing. I completely fucked that farm up. So, don't do that. Um, you're gonna have to have a smarter way of doing it. I think. Uh, how's the oxygen? It's getting very bad. Okay, so... Just pop it right next to the battery here. There we go. Is there more oxygen somewhere? CO2 up there. Nah, I think we're good. So we got the supercomputer here. There's no power because you haven't connected it yet. And now we have oxygen production. Uh, give me the planter boxes. Okay. Farm is done-ish. Mm. Okay. How many seeds do I have? I've got 10 mealwood seeds. 
Um, this is 16, so I think I will want to plant this as soon as possible. I just set the Lice Loaf to F forever and do 6. That's what I usually do every single time I get a... Uh, uh, what are they called? I don't even have it unlocked yet. Let's just do Mealwood Seeds and do this. I don't think I have enough seeds for this, but uh, let's do it and hope that the food is just going to last. And for now, I'm going to fix the flooring on a lot of these. Yeah. There we go. Um, what is the next priority? We need to dump our polluted stuff somewhere. Where would I stick that? This is kind of hot. Um, uh, this farm might not survive long. I might need to build another one. But looking at the temperature, like... It gets 30 degrees here. 30. 35. Yeah, like this area here is the coldest. I might need to actually move the toilets and the cots. Like, just mirror this around. Like, move the toilets to here and then move the bot beds to here. And that would be beautiful. Then the farm would be in the center of my base. Which I think is the coldest area so far. 22 through 23 yeah yeah I might need to destroy my uh, toilets and my beds well it's it's good to do it early on if you fuck it up later and it becomes a problem that's not great also uh get me uh the better batteries because these things don't last at all and these things the tiny batteries uh, they store up to 10 kilojoules. The big ones store up to 40. And you know the annoying part about them, they both produce the same amount of heat. Yeah, this, the, the big ones are four times better than the small ones, and they produce the same amount of heat. That's just ridiculous. You, you want to get rid of this battery as soon as you can. It is so inefficient. I think I'll just dump it, like, at the bottom here. Like, I can already do the wiring for it. So, you produce heat. Yeah, you produce more heat than the battery. I remember that. 1.5, 1.25. I don't know about you, but 1.13. Yeah, everything produces a little bit, which is why you kind of... You want to get them out of the spine eventually. You want to keep the spine kind of cold. If you can get Weezworts, that is amazing. Plant those shits everywhere. They eat up Phosphorite, which is you can get later on. But you can also, there's a trick to this. If you leave one of the undug tiles like this, you just leave it and you get like a storage bin. Like over here, just do one storage bin. You you can set it to accept one item, have it take one weas root, then you delete the box and the plant falls down on the ground and then it plants itself in the ground. Then you don't need to do deal with phosphorite at all. It will just grow without it. Which is really, really broken. And there's a lot of these little broken things in the game that I'm not a huge fan of, but... I don't know. I've been doing a lot of reading and watching videos and stuff about this game. I'm really completely fallen for this game. Um, and a lot of it is people cheesing the fuck out of things. I'm not a huge fan of that, but, you know. Uh, whatever. They're, they're using the game mechanics to their benefits, but... I don't know. Do you guys watch, like, people do Dark Souls speedruns? I get so fucking pissed when I watch those, because when I played Dark Souls, it took me fucking days to kill. I remember playing Sekiro, and the last boss in Sekiro, or well, I don't know, the last boss, yeah, it was the last boss in Sekiro, the old dude. Uh, it took me like 10 hours to kill him. I'm not kidding. I played the game for like 5 hours. Got nowhere. I think, no, actually, I did get to, like, the third phase once or twice. He's got four phases. 
Uh, and I was like, oh, Jesus, this is so difficult. I took a break, which is a bad thing to do because you lose all training. And I got to phase four, like, once or twice. For th I played that for three hours and I gave up. And then I came back, like, a few days later because I was so pissed. I played it for two hours and then finally killed him. And then these assholes are playing the game and completely just one-shotting and skipping everything and, and glitching it. And it just, it, it annoys me. It annoys me to no end. I feel like, I don't know, there's a lack of pride in those speedruns. But that's maybe just me. I want to see like, I want to see like a new category of speedruns just called a pure run. Where you don't do any of the bullshittery that people always do. They say glitch, yeah, glitchless runs, but they fucking abuse the fuck out of things in those runs, and I don't like it. Anyway, enough about speedruns. I'm not a fan. Maybe that's the uh, that's the uh, the caveat, the uh, lesson to take away here. I don't like speedruns. Um, I don't know why I'm doing this room here. I kind of just wanted to dig out the bricks there to see if we got some uh, muck root or something. We did not, but that's okay. You guys are idle right now. I'm trying to find you guys some work. Uh, I kind of just want to dig out a lot in my main base right now. Just fill it with oxygen moving forward. Uh, we'll just dig out all of this. What is this? Oh, that's polluted water. Oh, wonderful. Okay. I don't know. I, I like to complain a lot about different things. Like, I don't like Twitch. I've complained about that before. Um, yeah, maybe I just shouldn't start because I don't really stop once I start bitching. Do this here. We'll leave this polluted water for later. I'll deal with it later. Take all of this junk out. Okay. That's something for you guys to do. What's the priority here? Everything is five. Okay, good, good, good. The only thing being run by this power is... Yeah. I'm gonna delete you. Because now we got the jumbo battery. Which is... Yeah, look at that. Heat production. 1.25. Same heat... Generation as the small one, but four times the kilojoules. Absolutely ridiculous. Like, you basically just want to build one battery like this throughout your entire game. You don't need more. You don't, you don't, shouldn't build more. Uh, you need advanced research. Yeah, I should give you guys more skills. Narcoleptic on cultures. I don't like narcoleptic. These guys, they tend to die. I'll just take the water. Is it cold? Yeah, it's nine degrees. It's that's quite cold. We have a lot of sand. I keep seeing things fall down. I might need another one of these. We have 16 tons of algae. That's not bad. Let's see. Uh, smart ass, you are going to take the research. Dundee, you are my rancher. Yeah, you're going to be stuck basic bitch for a while until I get some more morale rooms. Because right now I've got these two. That's a plus one and a plus one. If I can get the showers, that's a plus three, I think. It doesn't show as a room, but it shows as a buff for the duplicates. And if I can get a great hall, oh man, that would be good. But I can now do advanced research. So go ahead and get me the deodorizer. I like to get that as soon as possible. I don't want oxygen to... Jesus. To accrue in my base, the polluted one. Do you, this, do you see this? There's a shine bug behind this tile just stuck there. Miserable as fuck. I'm going to let him out. Why did you get stuck in there, you idiot? You only have yourself to blame. And it looks like we have enough mealwood seeds for the farm now. It's growing unevenly, but it's okay. 
Hey, he's free. Congratulations. Don't get stuck again. You, yeah, it's just, it's just going to be Dundee. I'm going to have to get like a designated digger then. Yeah, because this map is going to have a lot of these bricks and I'm going to need somebody that can dig that out sooner rather than later. This little blotch of slime is, looks really weird inside this salt biome, doesn't it? It doesn't really belong here. But okay. Uh, I could ignore this little pocket here and just dig this down. I kind of want to do that. Um, I want to mop up this as well. I still don't have a pitcher pump, so the water that I have mopped up is the only water I have right now. Hey, thank you. Ah, uh, I'll delete this. Mop it up then. Okay, thank you. And if I dig all the way down here, the water's going to go down, and so is the CO2. I want to buy us a lot of time before I have to deal with the CO2. I don't really want to have to touch that stuff for a while. So I've been debating how, like, how long I should make these episodes. I'm thinking of like an hour, but I'm going to dump a bunch of these, I think, uh, over the next few days. So we'll have to see. It's the holidays. I'm sure people have... Some people will have free time to watch these. Some people will not. Some people have to cook shit. And I feel for you because I can't cook anything. I can boil water and put hot dogs in them. Does that count as cooking? Um, I, don't need to, I don't need to close this yet. This is not going to become a room anytime soon. Okay, shells. Okay, we have something we could potentially ranch. Can you become something different? No, you are just this type. Isn't there like a red one and like a gray one? You eat polluted dirt and rot piles. So yeah, you could feed, instead of having a compost, you could have this guy eat the polluted dirt. Let's see here. Okay, it, it, it excretes 50% of the consumed mass, so... He will eat 140 kilos and shit out 70 kilos of sand. Sand is okay, but I mean, it's not going to be insanely useful. You have other filtration mediums that you can use other than sand. We have airflow tiles, that's good. And like, it doesn't appear that we're going to run low on sand with all of these salt biomes all over the place. But I suppose it's an option. I've, I've never made a ranch of Pokeshell dudes. Uh, let's see. Did somebody else get a skill up? No. Yeah, we're still doing some research here. Uh, yeah, this is going to take a while. I think I'm going to go ahead and pause it right here, uh, 50 minutes. I'm going to basically go eat and then I'm going to keep recording. Um, so I'm going to make this as my break for episode one. I'm doing finger quotes, which is stupid because you can't see me. Why do I? Anyway, uh, but yeah, so hopefully you guys are going to have a very pleasurable holidays. If you are celebrating the holidays, uh, you would have to be, I guess, Christian to do that. I don't think anybody else celebrates Easter, do they? I'm being an idiot. Anyway, I will see you guys in the next episode, which will be in a few minutes for me. I don't know how long for you. We'll have to figure that out as well. 
So, until then, see ya. And thanks for watching.